What's going on, everybody, and welcome to Barley Plays. It's just me. It's just me for now. So, welcome to Barley Plays, a little bit of Conan Exiles. We played this before on our solo games. Um, oh, do I have, like, terrible quality here? What's going on? There we go. Um, all right, so we have we've played this before on our solo on our solo games, and you know it's been it's been uh, it's been pretty good. <clears throat> it's been fun. It's been fun for me. So you know, pull up pull up a chair, grab your beer, and we'll keep going with some Conan Exiles. So the idea is that hopefully, okay. So me saying something like this makes me super uncomfortable. But I want to kind of do Subnautica at some point because Hops pointed out. Hops pointed out. And it's and it's really not fair of her to have to do all of the horror games. And it's you know, it's it's it it comes a time in uh, every in every every young boy's life when he has to do something that scares him. And for me, I get that sweet, sweet primal fear from being underwater. So, Subnautica is basically my PT, my, um, I don't know, my amnesia, my Bendy and the Ink Factory. No, that's not right. Sorry, Bendy and the Ink Machine. That's not Bendy and the Ink Factory is the thing. But for now, unless I get an overwhelming, oh, unless I get an overwhelming, uh, you are, I don't know what a taskmaster even does. Oh, get away from me. Um, unless I get an overwhelming urge to stop, I think we're going to be doing some Conan, and then who knows, we'll, we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll stop, we'll talk for a little bit, and we'll play some Subnautica, and then I'll regret every decision I've made. Okay. So first off, Yala the Star. More like Yala the gonna get the crap kicked out of it. So what do Taskmasters associate with? Yep. Mm -hmm. Because oh god, oh my god. Don't, there's always a friggin' crocodile here every time. All right. Well, push my nose real quick. That's all right. What's up, buddy? What's up? Oh, Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Okay. Gods take you. Gods take you. Um, I don't know if you heard, but gods take you. There we go. Switch back to this. Oh, yeah. Just get hit right in the face, real quick. I got an iron truncheon now, which is great because the, the wood fight. truncheon that you start the game with friggin' sucks. There we go. Come on. Die. Yala the Scarred. This is going to take a long time. Shove some bugs in my mouth. What is it? Skyrim? Eat some food, regenerate some health. There we go. At least her patterns are pretty easy to. Oh, well, except for that one, I guess. Die. Holy crap. She is a friggin'. She's a beast. Taste death. Mama, taste death. Stop saying taste death. You picked the wrong fight. You picked the wrong fight. Blah blah blah. Oh, Curse yeah, you. here we go. Nope. Oh, okay. Oh, that's not good. Well, in case you are just joining, um, I've been fighting this woman for about two and a half hours now. Slight exaggeration. Take you. Please stop. Please stop. Thank you. Okay. Alright, let's grab some of our bindings here and grab her back. And let's get her let's get her working for us, huh? Let's get her part of the, the tribe here. Can I do multiple thralls at once here? Because I mean there's multiple dudes, right? I mean you're done. Like you're finished. Hyborian dancer? Come on, let's go. Where should I put the Hyborian Dancer? 
on the roof, I feel like, is a pretty good spot, right? Like, oh, that's not good. Like, I feel like on the roof is pretty good. They put them on the roof, you know. They can dance up there. I don't think they can eat. Um, that's not really my problem, though. Whatever. It's no big deal. <laughs> Who cares? Look at this guy. Friggin' Hurricanian Dancer 1. Yeah, that's what's up. So. It says I'm entertained, but in reality, I'm not. I don't really like this guy. Um, but he'll have a friend here. On the other side. Oh, no. Wait. Mm, should she be here or should she be here? Like, symmetry for here. But here, she's like, you see her from the other side as you're coming up. She's pretty good. I guess I'll put her here. There we go. Um, please start performing. Thank you. There we go. We've done it. I don't need ladders. I just shove my... I just fall down the sides of buildings. But speaking of, how do I make ladders? Ladder. Um, ladder. Hey, Reaper, what's going on? Um, it, If you're not really missing much, it's just me. Um, It's just... It's, oh, Carpenter's Man. It's just me streaming. I'm just streaming a little Conan Exiles, you know. Uh, nothing crazy, but we're going to be back later at 7.30 EST, which is 4.30 for you, I guess. Um, and it's going to be both me and Hops again, and we're going to be doing something together, maybe Dungeon Defenders or maybe something else. I don't know. We got a good suggestion by another uh, streamer named Francis the Black, and he suggested Dead by Daylight, which might be fun, but only if we can get like a set group of people. So Reaper... Real question before you go back to doing yard work. Do you own Dead by Daylight? Or do you have any ability to own Dead by Daylight? Because if you do, and we end up playing it, I think that'd be pretty cool to play like with people who are watching, with viewers. Your chat is really glitched. What is that? What's what's going on with your chat? I can see your chat okay. I'm just trying to live my life over here and make uh, hyena pelts. I can. Ju I don't even have to break them down, do I? I can just... Recipe leather. Yeah, that just goes right into it. You do own it. Okay. Because we're thinking about doing that, and I've heard some questionable things about the community. So, it would be great if we could just, like, keep it... Keep it with people that we know, you know? Just keep it, you know, keep it cool. Keep it... Maybe a bunch of amateur people who don't have a ton of experience. Stuff like that. But it might be fun, especially with Hops' aversion to horror games. So being stalked by another player, or maybe her stalking. I think she'd enjoy the her stalking part. Maybe not so much being stalked by another player. <laughs> oh. All right, so what are we doing here? We got the truncheon. I've got you all set up, so we can go out. All right, so in this, so what I want to do? What's my immediate goal? I'm trying to set goals for this game. I want to create a uh, a pleasure palace. My my religious thing. Pleasure dome of Darketo. Pleasure dome of Darketo. We're going to put that on the roof. Pleasure Dome of Darketo. Um, yes. Uh, I think it would be a lot of fun. But it would be a lot of fun only... It would be a lot of fun only if... Pleasure Place of Darketo. What are you talking about? Religion. Okay, it sounds good. 
Um, yeah, it'll be a lot of fun, but only people that we know, I think. I don't want to really play with a lot of random, random people. All right, so we need 360 stone, 160 wood, and 20 twine. Easy. E do we have the twine already? No? Well, we can get the twine real quick. 360 stone, 120 wood, 20 twine. 360 stone, 20 wood, 20 twine. And now the fun begins. Rock smashing 101. How are you doing, by the way, Reaper? Other than the fact that you have to do yard work now. I don't know, like... If you're still in here. But... How how are you feeling? Because the last time... Well, not the last time, but... When, when one of the times I talked to you before, right after the cruise, you were... Feeling a little under the weather. So, are you, are you back to normal? Are you back 100%? Get out of here. Bring in... Crocodile? What is this? Oh, it's just a dead deer. Oh my god. It's just a dead deer. Skin this guy. Cool. I'm really digging this. I, man, I did not think I was going to like this game. Desert berries. What? Desert berry bush seeds? Oh, that's awesome, Reaper. I'll have to check out the VOD. That's really cool. Congratulations. Still some bad coughs. Yeah, usually when I get sick like that, my coughs, for whatever reason, last forever. I don't know why. It just lasts. It'll last for like weeks, two or three weeks, and then eventually I'll get better. Boom. All right. So this pleasure place of Daketo, I guess I'll put it on the roof. I mean, I have this stupid little outcrop in here. Maybe this could be like, should I create like a separate religious building? I mean, here's like a, mm, I don't know what to do here. What were you streaming last night, Reaper? Were you doing more watchdogs? Okay. <laughs> See you later, Reaper. Have fun doing yard work. Can I climb up here? No, this will this will be fine. Just get get down. Oh my god, this thing's huge. Okay, I don't want this on my roof. I need like I need like a special spot for this. Oh broke both my legs. Crack this guy open. Sandstone frame. I don't think... I don't, I'm not going to build, like, a whole building. Right? That's stupid. I'm not going to build a whole building. I'm just going to build, like, a platform. Because I have to keep... I have to keep uh, expanding. So that means we have to get more wood and we have to get more... Uh... Yeah, we have to get more wood and we have to get more stone. So we can create that kind of stuff. All right. That's cool. That's cool. No big deal. Get put those aloe leaves in there. Get these des desert berries, these bush seeds, these fangs, the water orb, gaseous orb. I have no idea what those are for. And these crappy bone arrows, reptile hide, seeds. Yeah. All right. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Get some more rocks. Get some more wood. And then we can like we can push out that way. I guess. I think we can push out far enough that way. I'm going to have to build a pretty big... Oh, God. That was a lot of stone very quickly. I think one tree should do me. Now I'm just going to build a whole bunch of foundation. Sandstone foundation. What the hell? We don't need anything special. I'm, on the, I'm over in Cumbria. Yeah, that's fine. Sandstone... 14. Is that going to be big enough? I think we're going to have to build some more. Yeah, I think we're going to have to build some more. I can't see anything. Is this okay? Is this an okay brightness for everyone? 
Because it seems kind of dark. I mean, it seems dark on my screen, but I don't know if that's like dark on everyone's screen. Pop this over here, build some more foundations. All right, so once we build this pleasure palace, I want to upgrade it to the pleasure dome. And then... Seven. Seven. Seven, 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 seven. Just, just shove a whole bunch of bugs in there. Now. Then I want to upgrade it to the pleasure dome. And... Then we're going to go exploring. I want to find a dungeon. That's what I want to do. I want to find a dungeon tonight. Okay, I think, can we, how far over can we build? We can build pretty far over. That would kind of, that would probably <clears throat> screw up the spawn of those guys. Requires connection to landscape. Yeah, I mean, I hear you. Um, fail to place building. Fail to place building. Please place building better than that. Fail to place building. Requires connection to landscape. Fail to place building. I don't understand what's happening. Okay, that works now. All right, this might be a mistake. We'll see what happens. One, two, three, four. Yep. One, two, three, four. Perfect. <coughs> We're gonna pop down the pleasure palace of Darketto, which will face this way. That will face this way. Um, okay, give me that. <laughs> I guess we'll have it face this way. Place, left mouse button. Left mouse button. Thank you. Hey. Alright. So what can we do in here? So in here, the god in the bowl. We can upgrade it to a pleasure dome with manifestation of zeal. No idea how to get that. Iron reinforcement, shaped wood, and bricks. I know how to get all these. I have no idea how to get a manifestation of zeal. Darketto's kiss as tool for extracting unfulfilled desires. Hmm. Um, is that what we use? Is that what we use to do it? Is that what we use to do it? I don't know. All right. Well, that's okay. We can we can go over here and we can check it out. Pop this over. Pop this over. All right. Get a couple of these guys. So we need, it was like, it was branches and it was iron. So we can, I mean, that's not super resource intensive or anything. So we will just grab the branches we need. Oh, we already have the branches we need. Never mind. Okay. Let's make this thing. I'm assuming that's where you get the manifestation of zeals. What's going on, Taladay1410? We are playing a little bit of... Oh my god, this thing is a nightmare. Um, we are playing a little bit of... Conan Exiles today. And I would like it if Gray would stop by, because he's the one that was like, you should play Conan Exiles, you should play Conan Exiles. And I did, and then ever since I got into it, he hasn't shown up again. <laughs> so let me make this. So what thrall do I put in here? What does this do? Hallowed ritual harvest tool? Darketto teaches that when a person dies, their unfulfilled desires manifest within their bodies. The worshippers of Darketto have created this tool for extracting that remnant of from those who die while under their ministrations. Just don't look too closely at what it pulls out. What, you got recommended the forest? And then, or you, <laughs> or you mean with us? <laughs> I 
you don't mean with us, right? Because you were there for a lot of the forest, weren't you? Because you were <laughs> you were helping us. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. The person that recommended you the forest. <clears throat> <laughs> then gone, but then you got really into it. I mean, you were helping us all, so I mean, you know, maybe not all was maybe not all was lost for that. Oh, because you're looking for other people who are playing the forest. Yeah, I mean, I like the forest because this is probably a mistake because I think an absolute ton of people are playing Conan Exiles. How many hours do you have in the forest anyway? Out of curiosity. That's too personal of a question you don't have to answer. Uh, can this... Does this use... this? Does this also give me, like, stuff? Like, what does that do? <laughs> Nothing's too personal. Oh, really? Insulated wooden wall. Alright, let's see if I can't extract some unfulfilled desires from people. Am I running? Am I running this on full screen? There's a very, very low latency. It's very small delay between me and the screen, which is unusual for me. It's usually like 30 seconds, but right now it's like a couple seconds. I don't want any BS. 364 hours. So what's your favorite thing about the forest? Because, so, have you played Subnautica? For some reason, Subnautica and the forest kind of remind me of each other. Subnautica is like, feels like the forest, except for it's mostly underwater, which terrifies the crap out of me. I'm not about that underwater life. So, I'm tempted to play it because I think you would. Oh god, my body! Hold on, the fiery cook, please, uh, please get away from me for the time being. Excuse me, sir. Uh, have you met your Lord and Savior, uh, Father? Oh, cool. uh, excuse me, sir. Have you? Oh god! Oh my god! There we go. That's what's up. Thank you. I'm a little better. <laughs> I'm a little better equipped now than I when I was when I started. Like I have legit armor and I have like legit weapons and everything like that. Like when I first started, it was a nightmare. I was dying to everything. All right, so let's see if this extracts his unfulfilled desires. Human flesh, sliver of the unfulfilled. Human flesh, sliver of the unfulfilled. Manifestation of unfulfilled desire. Okay. I like... Yeah, I don't know if there's a lot of combat in Subnautica. I think it's more just terror of underwater creatures and then running away. Oh, please don't... Excuse me, sir. Oh, God. There you go. Pop. All right. And the what the forest jump scares? Yeah. Yeah, the jump scares are fun. Sure, sure, sure. Well, the when I played the forest by myself for the very first time, like yo, I don't want to use these for but get out of here, human flesh. I don't want human flesh. Well, when I first started playing it, like, it ranked up there. It was, like, one of the scariest games I have ever played. Climb up this wall, please. The way that they, like, circle you and the fact that they're kind of smart. And they'll, like, scout your camp and then run off. Yo, that, that got me. That got me pretty good. You like the forest, yeah. I mean, I didn't think I'd like the forest. Hold on, let me actually. Did that do anything? I don't think that did anything. That's just popping back to where it was. 
There's a lot. So I got a new monitor. Hold on. I just want to make sure it's the monitor and not this. Let me shield my face. Right yeah. I got a new monitor and it's so much brighter. So now my face constantly has this glow on it. I don't know how to get rid of that except maybe turning on a light. But that really works better at night. Hold on. Did I do anything? Did I do anything? Tea and toasty! What is going on? Long time no talk. How are you doing? I'm all by myself today. Well, just for the first part of today. I heard some... There was a game. <laughs> the jump scares in the forest are like next level. The jump scares are out of control. I, I hate... I mean, I hated the jump scares in the forest when I first started playing, but then it, it started to grow on me a little bit. I started liking it. I, I, I got Stockholm into it a little bit. Don't, yeah, don't apologize for not being in the stream. That's, that's absolutely, obviously, that's fine. You, you, uh, you've been going through a bunch of stuff. And you need sleep. You need rest. So you can get better. And Talladega, yeah, I don't know. The, the, the jump scares in the forest. I got used to them eventually. Oh, man. I don't like spiders that much either. Like, it doesn't freak me out a ton. But simultaneously, I'm not a huge fan of them. I'm just going to do this. You're welcome. So if you like the if you like the open world a oh god and a crocodile if you like the open world aspect of the forest you might kind of dig Conan it's a little it's less horror and it's more like an open world RPG but um, yes please sir please please crocodile if you would let me murder you that'd be super fantastic thank you yep it's right there. oh. Except the AI isn't as good as um, Conan. I mean, I'm not sure what a crocodile is supposed to do about this. It's a crocodile. It's not like it can climb up the side of a mountain. Maybe run away? If I had to guess. There we go. Uh, I'm the greatest player of all time. There we go. Easiest thing in the world. I'm not even going to skin them. Yeah, it is It is a little bit. I mean, it's not like they can climb up the wall to get me, but at the same time... Ugh. At the same time, I expect them to not just stand there and get shot at rep repeatedly. Oh my god. Look at this guy. In the world. I just want to check something real quick. I'm going to make sure. Gameplay, no server settings, combat. I have not lowered the damage. I have not increased my damage, and I have not lowered the damage taken. So, this is... I'm just making sure. I'm making sure that all of this is normal, and it is. So, I feel good about that. The, I um so both T and Tosi and Talladay we we definitely need different we need new oh please get out of my face thank you uh we need new games to play and so I was talking yes this is multiplayer I was actually playing it a little bit with fuck nah yeah see you later see you later suckers I'm out of here no fuck off. I'm sorry, this is a family stream. Ah, okay. What <laughs> what was I saying? I'm sorry. What was what was I saying? Um who a little bit with uh a little bit with hops. Please stop. I don't like these spiders, man. These spiders freak me out. Like, normal game spiders don't normally freak me out, but these guys are, like, real... These guys are real creepy. Get out of here. 
I don't know if either of you have played the original EverQuest, but in the original, oh shoot, in the original EverQuest, there was uh, this race of spider creatures called the Drachne, and they freaked me out pretty good. And I think that's the only other, I think that's the only other time that I've been freaked out by the spiders. Oh, also Minecraft. Minecraft spiders are freaky as hell. I don't care what anyone says. Minecraft is actually a horror game. Skyrim spiders never freaked me out. Nope. Skyrim spiders, I always thought, were like... I didn't understand. Oh, God. They're so fast and creepy. They're easy to kill, though. Um, Skyrim spiders... No, they never freaked me out. I know they, they had that mod that replaced spiders with bears. So you'd have, like, bears climbing down on webs and stuff like that. Oh, no. Nah. No. No. I'm not going in here. No, nah, frig off, dog. Oh, no. Don't shoot. Don't shoot your poison at me. I can tell when you're shooting. Because you do this whole body thing and you're a terrible shot. So am I though? Oh god. S excuse me? I'm out of ammo again? Oh, Alright, hold, hold on. Oh god. Get. Oh. Feral flesh. Oh, I'm using my Decato knife. Hold on, I don't want to use that. I want to use the skinning knife. Ah, I hate not being able to change things out mid. Thank you for reminding me. Also, thank you. Chitin. Did anyone else when they were young pronounce it chitin? I remember saying that in like fourth grade biology. I said chitin and the teacher got real mad at me. I don't remember why she got so mad at me for calling it chitin. I say it chitin in my head. I say when I look at the word, I say in my head, I'm like chitin. But then if I have to say it out loud, there's like a processing step where then I'm like, no, that's not what it actually is. Hold on. Oh, that's a dead spider. I don't need any more of that stuff. 140. Oh, that's right. That's what I made this stuff out of. I made this stuff out of chitin this mask and these pants so I can make more of that stuff so what are you what are you playing also Taladay um I dug your stream when I was watching it earlier I had a few streams up at the same time and I got into a cheering war with uh, someone on fuzzy green turtle stream I won and um so I had I was I was flipping back and forth. So if you were talking to me and I didn't respond, it was just because I I was either trying to mess with OBS and get that working or I was trying to um or I or I had you turned down a little bit for a small time or I was eating or something like that. Oh yeah, I was there for I was there for the whole time. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, I mean, it was just, yay, I spent more money. <laughs> Alright, where are we going? So I can go up there. So I want more of these, I don't know what these are for, these slivers of the unfulfilled, but I want more of them. Don't know why, but I do. Yeah, I saw you got a, you got a new follower too, in that stream. Oh my god, hold on. I did dig it. I don't know if anyone's commented. Your 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 audio, your mic audio is a little lower than your um is a little overshadowed by your in-game audio in certain times, like when you're getting chased by cannibals. But it's like it seems appropriate, but at the same like you know what I mean? 
like when loud noises happen, like when you're jumping into a lake or jumping into water, it gets a little mismatched, but all the other time it's pretty good. Can you please... Yeah, like, this AI is not super great. We're doing it, guys. I'm out of, I'm out of it. I'm out of arrows. I'm out of all my arrows. Um, hold on. Hold on. One second. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't like it was bad or anything. It was just the fact that sometimes when there was a lot of noise from the game, you got overshadowed a little bit. I don't, I don't really know how to fix that. I mean, we've had sound issues from day one. I don't want to fix anything, so... Excuse me. <laughs> please don't. Please don't attack me. No, no, no. Please don't attack me. Oh, actually, no. You can attack me because you're in. Uh, you're in stabbing range. Oh my god. Pretty big words for people in stabbing range. Right? Oh god. There we go. armor. Look at all these arrows. This is exactly what I was looking for. I don't need any of this stuff, though, but that's pretty cool. Oh, right. Let me let me get their... Let me steal their souls or whatever I'm doing with this thing. Uh, T and Tosi, don't get me started on sound issues. I'm, I think sound issues are just like... It's just something that you have to deal with for the rest of your life if you want to do this thing because... I was watching a bigger streamer, and he didn't test the game beforehand. Um, he didn't test the game beforehand, and even he started having sound issues. And he's been doing this for years and years and years and years. <laughs> it's just all different games have different sound, you know? I don't know if there's much you can do about that. Let me pick up some branches here. I'm glad this guy's really being patient, because, like, I'm... Uh, craft two? I need more sticks. Just hold on. Don't... Don't retaliate yet. Just let me... Let me... Pick up some more sticks super fast. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There we go. All right. MacGyver would be proud of me. Oh, let me get a couple more rocks here. There you go. Crap two of those. Get rid of you. Rocket League is stupid for... I'm sorry, my speaker is blocking the uh, chat. My Rocket League is stupid for sounds because there's actually isn't any sounds... Like, I had a lot of people moan about the lack of in-game audio, but that's because it was super silent in the game. Yeah, there's not, uh, there's not a lot of stuff in Rocket League. I mean, you can hear the car and, like, the explosion when you make a goal. That's pretty much it. Also, what's up, bro? Um, excuse me? I need to give you a little message. It's called, oh, man, you refilled your health. All right. All right, that's all right. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're good. Bowen, hunter of bugs. All right. Well, so far this is going great. Yo, I don't care. I would normally try to get you, but oh, this is a mistake. Oh, I made mistakes here. Hold on. What a terrible title. Bowen Hunter of Bugs. Nope. Please stop. Please stop. Yo, you are. Oh, I could Your use an armor, but. Be Man, Jesus crap right now. Oh god. Get out of my face. There we go. All right. 
I guess so. Also, what did you have? What is this? Iron War Axe. I'll take that. Bear Pack. What does this do? Equip for strong necks only. Only bonus encumbrance. How much bonus encumbrance? A lot of bonus encumbrance. But it takes off my mask. Um, I don't like that. <laughs> Use this. Uh, iron stone and bone. Oh my god. I don't need all that bone. I have tons of bone. Everything's so heavy. Uh, maybe I should equip the bear pack. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> We've done it. Does this look good? Do I look stupid? <laughs> Let me get some of this slivers of this unfulfilled here. I want to kill this bug hunter. Get out of here, human flesh. Also, stone throwing axes are terrible. Just FYI. Oh, I'm crippled, so that was a waste. I need more human flesh. Looks like a medieval RV. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's a good way to describe it. Zerog Clawinator. Oh, Jesus. Zerog, please. Zerog, please. Zerog, I can't see anything. I have a giant backpack on. Very rude for you to... Oh, my God. She just exploded. She just exploded in a fountain of blood. Cool. Iron head arrows, purple dye. Okay. Okay. I would... Mm, okay. I want to kill... I want to kill Trogdor the Burninator up here. The archer, the bug hunter. Oh, I already killed her, didn't I? Ow, don't friggin' shoot. God. There we go. Let's get him. Yep. Shoot an arrow at me. Just get it out of your system. And that is the lore of... Oh. That is the lore of Conan. Just absolutely... <laughs> Bow and Hunter of Bugs. I mean, she had no chance, right? Falcana. Bow and Hunter of Bugs just had no shot. Like, all she does is hunt bugs, and here I come up with, like, a sword. Sorry. Not sorry. Can I get this to fire sword? Yes. Cool. I they'll be alright. I think I'll think they'll I think they'll recover. I think they're gonna be okay. I have faith in them. All right, I'm gonna get rid of these stupid throwing axes. They'll be alright. Just give it give it give it about ten minutes and I'm sure they'll be back doing what they gotta do. Because that seems to be about the time it takes. Why am I crippled? Seven. Am I missing something? Healing wraps. Use. Crippled. Oh, I can't move while using healing wraps. I see. That makes sense. I thought it was just like an in-combat healing item. But no, I can't use, I can't move while using healing wraps because yeah, that makes a lot of sense. I get it. Because how the hell am I doing that? They'll be fine. Don't even worry about it. It'll be okay. All right. Let's get back to base. Catch a fish, die an item, find somebody to talk to. My journey goals up there are like my real life goals. Die an item, catch a fish, and just find somebody to talk to, man. You know, just have a heart to heart with somebody. After all, you were a you were a slave. I know, maybe you weren't a slave. Maybe you were just 
You were just hung up on a cross. All right. When I get back to base, I need to... Someone, yeah, someone that doesn't... I've been trying to have meaningful conversations with everybody I walk by. And I'm like, hey, what's going on? And they just... They just... Try to chop off my head. I'm like, come on, man. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to have a nice little conversation. I'm just trying to, you know... I just want us to live our lives together. Sometimes, though, I do find if you knock them unconscious, then tie them up, and then then break their will to live they do hang out with you a lot longer and they'll become your armorers and your blacksmiths and your guards please stop please stop don't, don't touch me Some more no stop it stab oh my god what is this Tanner? I don't need a Tanner. Ooh, I don't need another fighter. Either. I'm pretty good with fighters. There we go. Do you have anything I want? What is this? Exceptional Falcata. Yes. Glowing Essence. Don't even know what that is. Here, you can have human flesh, I guess. Don't need that. Maybe... Like this iron war axe, no, I can I can screw off. All right. So one of my biggest complaints about the forest, um, even though I really enjoyed the game, was the frequency in which you need to eat and drink. Like that, it, it seemed like it was a lot, to the point where I was like, because we, we'd be like running through caves and everything we'd have to stop the pacing of the whole game sorry we'd have to stop the pacing of the whole game in order to freaking chop up some cannibals and eat them and you know that's a good saturday sure but it's too much man it's too much of the game all right yala the scarred what was she oh no it is more like survival again my general beef with survival games though is that every single survival game apparently thinks that in real life you need to eat and drink water about every 15 minutes otherwise you'll just collapse duck through that door there <laughs> make well look look at me look at me in this world I used to be naked and afraid. I used to be inches away from death. But now look at me. I have a veritable... S corporation here. Full of unpaid interns. That are all doing this work for college credit. This guy's majoring in smelting. He's pretty good. Uh, blacksmith major. This guy is uh, actually working on his PhD right now. This person, uh, the Tanner, I don't remember. Culinary arts. So, you know, we have, we have a whole group of people here. All right, let me say, <laughs> sorry, I'm just, I'm just saying nonsense. Put this stuff away. Oh, Yala the Scarred was a Taskmaster. That's right. What are we supposed to do with a Taskmaster? We... I mean, I know what a Taskmaster is for, you know, theoretically, but... What do we do with, um, with her in here? Do we put her on the torturer's table, maybe? Torturer's work table? Thrall? Yala? Oh, she can make chain bindings. I guess, I guess her job is here on the, um, look at that. Look at her just 
staring at our hands like a friggin' weirdo. We need to have, like, employee screening or something like this. This is ridiculous. Okay. I'm so... I'm ten entertained. I'm so entertained right now. <laughs> Let's see. This is sliver of the unfilled. Let me put this in here. You over here. Hallow leaves. <clears throat> So these healing wraps are pretty good for healing, but the aloe leaves also make aloe extract potions, which are like just straight up health potions. Like you just chug some aloe and all of a sudden all your wounds start melting, mending back together. You know, just like real life. All right. We need to figure out, ooh, what is this? What is all this stuff? Oh, I have, I have a lot of stuff. Alright, let's, let's see what armor we can make. Acolonian armors, I can't do. I can do Nordheimer armors, that's nine. Armor smith. Armor plating can be attached to increase the strength of armor crafted at armor's bench. Yeah, let's do you. Hmm. I, I don't know what to do. Anger and Greed, Dual Lust Taker, Powerful Sword, Blessed by Durketto. Damn. I can make that a level 50. Oh, Lust Taker. Oh. Lust Taker. Upgrade to Pleasure Palace. Crafted at Pleasure Palace of Durketto. This spiky plant is well known healing properties when made into a potion. Transmute. Decomposed. Oh, a handful of decomposed organic matter. Oh, okay. That's the pleasure dome I need. I can just do honey now. Hmm, okay. That's cool, I guess. Master Mason. Let's do stone. Yeah, why not? I'm a master mason now, everybody. Hooray! <sighs> Unlock the falcata. I'm going to do the long sword, and I'm going to do the falcata. Dual falcatas. Yo. I'm making all sorts of cool stuff. Turan, two-handed weapons. Turanian pike. I'm sorry. I um I bought the I bought the season pass, and now I'm just like finding all of this cool stuff that I couldn't do before. Six. Oh, I'm so close. All right, but that means I can I can I can boost this now. I can do it now. Hold on. Exceptional falcata. I can mend it right with with iron. No, I can't repair it yet. What the hell? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. Terranian war axe. Oh, dude, these look awesome. Terranian daggers, Terranian pike, Terranian greatsword. Yo, look at these things. Do you think this is any good? There's only one way to find out, right? We'll make that guy. And we'll make this guy. I have plenty of stuff. These look awesome. I love them. Terranian sword. Health damage. No, these are garbage. These are garbage items. That was a mistake. Alright. Um, I will be right back. Just give me a quick minute.
Sorry about that. I'm back again. <laughs> it doesn't automatically uh, unmute. All right. All right. So, um, what was I saying? We, all right, so what are we doing? All right, I have to get back into it now. Let's see. We've got black ice reinforced wooden foundation. What? This kind of stuff is garbage. So, we need to get these zeal things. Manifestation of zeal. Manifestation of zeal. Mani no, manifestation? Zeal? Um, ze <laughs> zeal? I don't know how to make these manifestations of zeal. Elixir of Freedom. Durketto's Kiss. Hmm. <laughs> Um, let's see. I'm trying to look up to see how you get manifestation of manifestations of zeal so we can keep going. Crafting the reliver religious tool knows gives zeal. That's probably necessary. Crafts the tools over and over, especially when... But how, how do I get it, though? How do I... How do I get the manifestation of zeal? Uh, here we go. Um, how's your domain? How's your place? Oh, just craft elixir of freedoms for insects and slivers. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's that's weird. Alright. That's fine. I can do that. Psh. I just have to get a whole bunch of insects now. Alright. But first is time to get more aloe. Oh my god. Create like a thousand. I have to make 30 of these things? Yo, that's insane. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll just... I guess I'll just farm for insects then. Does anyone know a better way to get insects? Oh, other than just running around, grabbing them out of bushes? Doop -a -doop -a -doo. Compelling gameplay. Good stuff. Good stuff. A handful of insects. A handful of insects. Hmm. So I'm I'm looking for uh, I'm looking for a another game to play solo. Because there's a lot of people who play Conan. So I don't know if this is... this is, And there's a lot of people that play Conan much better than I do. So this seems like a pretty uh, tapped market already, we'll say. But I know there's a lot of people that do Subnautica and a lot of people do the rest of them. So I'm just trying to figure out like... Because we're doing Dungeon Defenders by ourselves. Oh god, that scared the hell out of me. Please, please don't. Look, it's cool, man. Don't worry about it. I'm not trying to jump. Not trying to f with you. Nope. No, I'm not even gonna mess with you. All right. Just peace. Peace be with you, man. Peace be with you. See you later. You jerk. Nope. Not you either. I'm not gonna mess with you. No. I don't care. 
I'm not gonna do it. See ya. See ya later. Uh, can I can I eat bees? Yes, I can. I can eat bees. Just pop a bee in your mouth real quick. No big deal. Future needs. Okay. Alright, let's see here. The mm, sliver of the unfulfilled. Yeah, so I only need eight of these, right? Eight. Because it's only one of these and ten insects. And then that'll give me a single. Uh, sliver of the unfulfilled. Yes. There you go. There you go. And that'll give me, I guess, a single thing of zeal. Do I have any other insects? Like, oh, I do. I have a ton of insects, actually. Okay. I didn't have to farm any insects then. Let's pop over here. Put this in here. Okay. And let's just make a whole bunch of elixirs of freedom. So this should give me, according to the thing, this says this should give me the zeal. There it is, the manifestation of zeal. So every time I do, any time I do something like this, I also get a manifestation of zeal. Elixir of freedom, a concoction that frees the imbiber. And I need 30 of these in order to... Yes, in order to upgrade to the pleasure dome, I need 30 of them. Yo, that sucks. That sucks a lot. <coughs> Uh, yeah, let's just get some oil. What is weighing me down? Oh, it's all the friggin' aloe. Get all my aloe up in here, man. Oh, well, that's no, 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 not all my aloe. I have to take all of these back. Stop. Stop being crazy. What's weighing me down? Is it the iron? The iron's a little heavy. The twine? Twine's not heavy. Arrows? No. Oh, it's a, yeah, it's a 8,000 plant fiber I have. Okay. There we go. Get this oil out. Boom. Oh my god, my eyes. Pop that in there. Do you think I can do, like, tar? Like, fluid press a tar? No. Let's see, all right. Huh. I'm trying to think. All right. Let's go. Let's go. So I'm done with all this nonsense. Let's actually go do something. So I know I have to use, I have to get like 800 or whatever manifestations of zeal, and that's fine, but we need to go exploring. We need to check out what's beyond the wall here. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? S sir? Sir? Sir, please? No, no, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm okay. Everything's okay. I'm not trying to do anything to your, your friggin' children or anything. Let's go. Up here. Boop. Yeah. Boop. Cool. So, uh, I'm going to avoid this giant. I'm going to avoid this giant crocodile over here because I feel like it's going to just kick my ass. I mean, I won't avoid this guy. But I want to go to a dungeon. I don't know where any of them are. Other than those little dungeons like the uh, spider dungeon. There's... Oh, I did find... Actually, I did find... That's not true. 
excuse me. Um, please, please. Yeah. There we go. Let's keep going. Yo, there's too many crocodiles. I feel like the most. <laughs> I feel like the enemy that I'm fighting the most in the game are crocodiles. All right, let's go. Let's figure this out. So, first things first, I wanna check out these Sentinels. I've been here briefly before, but I don't know, I don't really know what's here. I also, ooh, you know what else I have? I also have, I have some healing wraps, so I'm good. And I also would like to get some feathers real quick from uh, Turkey Robinson over here. There we go. There's something in this area I think I remember I'm supposed to be careful about, but I don't remember what it is. Let's go ahead and... Yay. Is there something? Ooh. It's a hyena. Is that just a normal hyena? Yes. There's nothing special about that hyena? No? Okay. I thought there was like a, a special hyena over here. Like a corrupted hyena. But here we are, we're at the Sentinels. The only reason I know that it's called that is because it's on the map. As the Sentinels. Okay. What, um, all right. Uh, what's up? Please don't attack me. See you later. I feel like I feel like there's just a whole lot of nothingness around here. That's all right, though. Getting kind of an ominous feeling here, being over here. All right. I don't want to die. Because I don't want to have to get my body from this far away. Hmm. Who are these people? Boom. Gotcha. Tagged. Tag, son. Oh, no ammo. That's not okay. I mean, that's fine. I don't need ammo. I'm gonna aim to. I'm gonna aim to kill somebody. Oh my god! Oh my god! Please stop. There we go. Oh my god! This game is freaking too dark. All right, what do you have? You've got nothing. But give me your sliver of the unsullied not sliver of the unsullied unfulfilled this is not game of thrones there we go sliver of the unfulfilled i love it i don't want your human flesh though. that's like completely worthless to me i know i killed another one there you are what a weird... Okay. Feathers. Drop all these. Alright, what else we got over here? Nothing. Nothing. 
nothing but a big bonfire. Bo 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 bonfire. We run up here. Huh? I don't even know if anyone can see. Ooh, what was that noise? Sorry, Emma. This is new territory for me. I don't know where I am. Oh, I'm walking back towards the desert, so I really have to go like this way. Yeah, I don't want to walk back out to the desert, because I'm pretty sure that'll just kill me, won't it? I don't think you can go anywhere in the desert. Can you? Yo, it's one of these dudes. I haven't seen one of these dudes in a long time. What's up, bro? Yep. I'm gonna go this way. This is like friggin... I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go a little bit further here. I'm going to see what's going on. Because we do have we do have these guys here. Flint head arrows. What the frick? Oh, this is grubs? No, never mind. I don't need you. How far away am I from home? This is crazy. Alright, let me see. Once I finish this up, I think... So, when I switched to my new computer, um, I stopped my Seven Days to Die stuff. Got, like, murdered. So, I lost my entire solo game. So, once I get to... Once it ticks over... So, about ten minutes, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to stop playing Conan and switch over to Seven Days and try to start off again. I could also switch to a different game, but I don't know what other game to switch to. So if anyone has any suggestions. But yeah, I think I'm going to do... Switch over to 7. Mm -hmm. Where are you? Nah, man. Crocodile. Get out of here. Get out of here. BS. Uh, roll. There we go. Yeah, I could do dungeon. Do you think... Do you think Hops would get mad at me if I played dungeon defenders by myself? Kind of itching dungeon fenders a little bit. Oh my god. If I streamed dungeon defenders myself. I just got the alert, T and Toasty, playing Layers of Fear on his channel. If you want to go check that out. I'm not trying to drive anyone away, but that should be probably pretty entertaining. I want to see him play a horror game. Man flesh. Man flesh. Oh my god. 
what is this? No. There we go. Why'd you say man flesh? That was a weird thing to say. Here. Score shit eye gouger. Oh. Sore, sh sore shut eye gouger. There we go. Man flesh. Sounds like I'm playing Defari Kujal. Sounds like I'm playing that game um, Shadows of Shadows of War. Shadows of Mortal. It's always man flesh from the orcs. Oh wow. <laughs> okay, so let's see. 223. Alright, so I'm going to actually shift over here. And I'm going to stop here for Conan Exiles. Quick game. And we are going to play a little something a little different. We're going to play Seven Days to Die. And it's going to be brand new Seven Days to Die. Barley's screen is gray. Seven days. Seven days. One second. I gotta go. Uh, I gotta go switch it over on OBS. In just a minute. In just a minute. Had to update it there. All right, here we go. Seven days to die. So I'm going to be doing. Oh, good. All right, it did switch over. All right, so I, I I don't have I don't have my old game, so let's do. Oh my God, yes, yes, full screen. Hold, hold, hold on, back. Stop. Get out of here. Get out of here. Quit. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Play. Show game launcher. Exclusive full screen mode. Save as run as default. Yes. Yes. 2560 by 1440. Good. Play. All right. That's what I wanted. Cool. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, quality preset. Um, ultra, please. So, I have a new... I have a new uh, computer... And to say it politely, to say it politely, this game, oh my God, what the hell is happening? To say it politely, this game is not optimized very well. So I'm curious as to what ultra quality will play like on seven days to die. So I went from a 980 Ti, quit, just quit. I went from a 980 I went from a 980 Ti to a 2070. So, fingers crossed. No, don't do windowed, man. What are you doing? 2560. Play, yes. There we go. Video quality ultra awesome. It's going to on my 2070, I'm probably gonna get like 10 frames a second. Okay, new game. Solo random. Oh, 
Barley's Barley's world. We'll do uh, new random world. Generator world name. Zuhe. Oh, advanced generation. No, I wanna I wanna name it. I wanna name it something. I don't wanna name it Zuhe. Territory. Alright, world generation see. Just yeah, make it huge, man. Goyudo Mountains. Oh, I see. That's pretty cool. North Nefford County. Or Nefaro County? North Neforo County? Alright. Availability. Friends only. Um We're gonna do normal difficulty. 24 hour cycle, 60 minutes. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. 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 I guess we can just do everything. We're gonna up the XP multiplier a little bit. Not 300%, but like 150, just so we level up a little bit quicker. We're also gonna up our block damage a little bit, just so we don't spend so much time uh, grinding, grinding stuff. Loot respawn time, 30 days, drop on death, everything, drop on quit, nothing, my loot count, eight enemies, I don't know what this means. This sets the number of zombies per player on Blood Moon hordes. I mean, sure, eight enemies. G mode off, mark hair drops off. Multiplayer. Okay. Alright, so Barley's World, new random. Alright, there we go. Let's do it. Let's kick it. <laughs> oh, right, this is gonna take a while. Generating socket height data. So, like, what I'm, I'm curious what I should be, what kind of games I should be playing when I'm solo like this. Because it's hard to maintain sort of a sense of, it's hard to maintain a sense of entertainment with, like, Age of Conan. Because there's not really a lot of tension to it, it's just a lot of building. And that seems more like a solo game or a multiplayer game, like if we had a whole bunch of people doing it. But... We'll see. Seven Days to Die. Seven Days to Die is a good multiplayer game, too. Um, trying to stream this thing is a pain, but, like, should we do more story-based games? Should I do... I want to do Subnautica, man. I don't want to do Subnautica at all. Oh, my God. Do more horror-based games? Do more, uh story-based games do because one of my favorite games is vampire the masquerade bloodlines and i know a lot of people are probably playing that right now because the sequel was announced but that's that's a game i would like to sort of have a playthrough of just kind of see see if that gets any interest because not i don't think a lot of people play that or at least they didn't used to and now i'm not sure with the with the big change. All right, while this is loading, I'll be right back. 2 seconds. Exporting generated data. Oh my god. 
I need to get like another. I need to get another um, Elgato. Hook it up to the PlayStation or hook it up to the Switch or something. I guess you could just do that with the one I currently have too. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't realize how long this takes. This takes forever. It's like a hundred degrees in here. What's the temperature inside? Oh my god. It says it's 96 outside. It feels like 108. Yes, allow. Why would you do this to me? Windows. You're killing me, Windows. You're killing me. Please don't spawn me in the cold. All right. Yeah, the wasteland. Yeah, I know. Okay, basic survival. Yeah, I hear you. Oh my god, my mouse sensitivity. My mouse sensitivity is insane right now. Hold on. <laughs> Down this a little bit. Boop. That's not what I want. Oh, V-Sync off. Apply. Don't on full screen me. Oh my god, seven days to die. You're killing me. You are actually killing me. That's much more. All right. Okay. So, here we go. I'm actually surprised I can play this game on Ultra, considering. All right. So we gotta, we gotta do the usual. We gotta freaking punch grass. There we go. Get enough grass to place a bedroll. I'm already nervous about zombies showing up. But I think... I think, um... T and Toasty said that if you don't stray too far from your spawn point, you're, you aren't going to get attacked. So... I just there we go oh man the graphics are good when you can just brute force it okay, I'm gonna make a bed roll I also want to pick up I can oh, no that's the forest right I was like can I smash people with stones no that's not this game look at this little cabin this would be an awesome house we spawned right... I think we spawned right next to our future home here. Punch some little baby trees here. Get these. Get some cotton plants. Look at this. Look at this. This is a freaking... Uh, it's a... Uh, oh, cornucopia. There you go. That's the word I'm looking for. A cornucopia. Got stones. Oh yeah, we got cotton, we got stones. We got so much good stuff here. It's out of control. I love it. I am nervous about finding a zombie, but because I don't have a weapon or anything yet. But I do have a bedroll. So we'll place a bedroll. I'm just gonna place it here to get the Stuff. There you go. Placed it. Did it. Pick it up. What's the next step? Come on. Let's go. Craft a stone axe. Okay. Oh, bullets. I will clap. I will craft a stone axe. Okay. 
All right. There we go. I think, uh, oh, the plant fiber clothes. That's right. So we, we, we need the, the pants, the shirt, the hood, the pants, shirt, hood, shoes, pants, shirt, hood, shoes, gloves. So as soon as that's done, yeah. Yeah, Regaltis. It's um it, <laughs> it's it looks like it sucks outside. <laughs> it looks absolutely miserable. I'm miserable in here. Like I'm I I can feel my energy draining so quickly and I'm indoors. It's already hot and sweaty in here. I'm trying to keep my Here we go keep my energy up a little bit because good lord also I'm I'm honest I mean I know this is a big upgrade from I know this is a big upgrade from the 2070 or uh, I know this big upgrade from the 1080 but even with the 2070 I still didn't expect it to run seven days to die <laughs> At a good frame rate. I don't know if that tells you anything about what I consider the about what I consider the uh, performance of Seven Days to Die. Oh my god, that's horrendous! That sounds horrible. Put that there, put that torch there. This way, and claim block is garbage. I don't care. Oh my god, that sounds miserable. Having the AC off, or having the AC off? Good lord. That sounds. No, I don't think. I don't, th I don't know about that. Um, arrow? Let's just give me all of the arrows. I can only do... Oh, because I don't have any stone. I did. I crafted two boat. I crafted two arrows. Are you proud of me? Oh, God. I didn't even notice that it's... It's lagging on the, on the, uh... No, I mean, my game is playing fine. And OBS says it's fine, too. That's why I was surprised. I was like, wow, I can't believe this is actually playing well. But then I just looked at, looked at the stream, and it doesn't look like it's playing well at all. One second. Let me go look at what OBS is saying. I have no idea what would be causing that. Unless that's just like my personal... Uh, my personal stream being laggy. Is it, Regaltus, is your stream... Is your stream laggy? Does it look laggy on your, your side? Because it looks fine when I'm playing. I'm like looking at it on OBS and it's going over fine. It's looking smooth. It's always something, man. What the hell? It's always freaking something. Alright, let's pop over here. Hello? Any zombies? No? Hello? Hello, zombies?
Let me see what Obi has to say. Then there's a pop in the clarity. OBS says we're streaming at a uh, 300 bit rate. I mean, not 300, uh, 3000. Um, please, please get away from me. You look so much worse when the graphics are up high and not on low. Oh my god. I miss playing this game on low. <laughs> Let me, I'm going to refresh my, well, I don't, I don't know what to, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on because I, my, my game is running very well. My game is running well. The, oh, OBS is saying that it's not dropping any frames. There's no CPU. It has to be network. I wonder if it's because I'm trying to send it over at 1440. Hmm. I'll have to refresh mine because I don't mind super laggy, but mine could be used to be super laggy because I'm watching it on. Oh, because I'm watching it on the other monitor. And maybe that's just how uh, 60 hertz monitors are now. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I hear zombie. I hate you. Okay. Oh, cooking pot right off the bat. Right off the bat. I love it. What else do we have here? Do we have any food? Iron? I could create a reinforced... Oh, electric bar is amazing. I could create a reinforced... Yo, this is... This is creepy. What the hell? I don't want to go down there. Search weapons bag. Hmm. Pop this guy open. I'm pretty sure this just takes us around to the other side. Oh, I forgot I was doing this little quest here. the uh, reinforced like the iron what do I need for the iron reinforced club iron a hundred iron and wood oh okay so I can scrap you that's raw iron Sc can't scrap you can't really scrap a whole lot of stuff hmm. Op, boom pistol love it pop you down there Got a pistol already. Man, I'm liking this. I'm liking this level. This is generated world. But then I get to go down here and see. Oh, good lord. What is this? Oh. Oh, hello. Um. Please. Please. I don't I don't think so because the the 4k model is about is almost as twice I think almost as twice almost twice as expensive than the standard uh, 1080 model 
I know it's at least a hundred dollars more. And since we can't stream in ten, and since we're never going to stream in in four K, um, and we don't really plan on ever streaming in. 1080 this janky way of doing it i think is fine as long as it comes through okay but i'm a little concerned that it's not coming through okay even though everything over here says that it should be going through okay but when i look at the when i look at the actual when i look at the actual stream it looks stuttery on my side Now the real question is, is should I here let me repair this real quick. Should I live here? Or should I go somewhere else? I'm leaning towards somewhere else just as I keep <laughs> I keep breaking everything. <laughs> Try to get through. There we go. Get some iron. Try to make this iron. I want to make this iron thing. What's in here? Just live in this shed. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice, yeah. Just live over here. Done. Give me that. Oh, oh, I'm near like a radioactive area. That's good. <laughs> I can't argue with that. I, I can't argue with that logic. <laughs> so we we can stream in so many so many resolutions. Just all of the resolutions. That'll be great. Iron Reinforced Club, grab that. Yeah, that's 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 definitely one way of looking at it. Let me craft these frames. Frames. Three. There we go. This game looks dramatically better. So Regeltis, I'm so sorry. I'm so so sorry that I've ever I ever questioned you when it came to like 1440 and 144 hertz. Like this is tremendous. This is the the monitor difference and just everything like everything looks better. It's unbelievable. Like the difference, the quality difference is just out of control. you down here just to get rid of the thing right upgrade I'm sad that I lost like all of my progress though I could probably transfer it over from the stream from my uh, other PC but meh. I guess I'm not that sad about it gather small stone to build a campfire okay It's sad when you stop noticing it. Yeah, I imagine eventually I'll just notice it the other way. I'll like be doing I'll be using like a 1080 monitor and I'll just be like, "Oh, this is this is awful." <laughs> Cuz I already when I move my mouse over to the other monitor, I can already notice like the difference and I'm like, "How like how exactly did I do this before? Because the difference between 1080 or the difference, yeah, the difference between 1080 and 1440 and the difference between 60 hertz and 144 hertz is massive. Work on Monday through a VM. Oh, God. 
just put that down. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. I, I can make a new one. Good job, Survivor. We've done it. We completed basic survival. Scrap this. And yeah, that's fine. Okay. Hi, Hops. What's going on? We have a. How's work going? I, I don't think so. Uh, Conan did, but this didn't. Hopperoon. This is such a silent game. Like, you don't notice how quiet it is. Unless you're playing it by yourself with nothing else going on. Then you notice how quiet it is. Or is your air conditioner? Yeah, your air conditioning is still broken, right? Like, it should be... It's like a... Damn near a crime to have broken air conditioning with weather like this right now. Like, that's that's crazy to me that it's still broken and they can't figure out why. I mean, our air conditioning at work breaks constantly too, but it doesn't stay broken for a long period of time. Also... Because are you are you um oh what is this? What is this freaking cave system? What is this thing? What's happening here? Mhm mm mhm mm mhm. Um, is this like an underground military bunker that I just stumbled into? What is this? Uh, oh, oh, I heard something. I see a leg right there. I don't. I knew it. Please stop. Thank you. Please stop. Thank you. Every time I think about broken air conditioners, all I think about is that Camaro that we uh, rented when we were in New Mexico and how the air conditioner broke in, new, um, in a New Mexico summer. Like, r immediately. Excuse me, sir. I know you're alive. Don't do that. Don't try to make a fool out of me. Yeah. Oh my god. Look at you. You are such a fool. Uh oh. Alright, I need to go back up to that house. <laughs> Spamming Liz motes. Lizzie motes. What was so bad? The the emote? What what was so bad? What I'm doing? What's going on? How much uh, longer do you estimate that you have at work? Please stop crawling towards me. Please stop. Sir. Sir. Thank you. There you go. You got it. An hour? Oh man. Oh, um has the has the freshly been delivered? By the way. Cause as soon as I'm done here, I'm probably gonna have to go down and get that. Alright, I have to go back to the house. Give me that. 
Uh, I don't know where to live. Like, I have to pick a place to live pretty soon because it's going to be night. Also, Hops, if you can, if you, if you're able to see the screen, if you're able to see the stream right now, is the stream like choppy? Regeltis said the movement looked fine, but there was like a, when I stop, it was like a pop in for quality or something like that. And on my screen, it looks choppy. And it's probably because I'm trying to stream it myself too, but like the game itself is fine. There's no bottlenecking. Looks fine for you. Okay. It's just me then. It's just the fact that I'm trying to keep an eye on the stream and my computer is probably just like, we're just, we're going to put this as a secondary thing. Don't really worry about that too much. I can't believe that I'm actually playing this on Ultra. This is what Ultra graphics are meant to look like. Look at that. Incredible. Mild sarcasm. Surprised my computer hasn't exploded yet. The optimization of Conan Exiles is amazing compared to this thing. Like the nine the my nine eighty TI could barely run this thing at a steady like forty frames a second on medium. I know Hops's computer. Maybe you're just seeing the 144 to 30 FPS drop side by side. I didn't even think about that. That we're streaming in... Well, I mean, we should be streaming in 60, actually. Yeah, we should be streaming in 60, not not uh, 30. Unless it's just processing on my side as 30 to save... To save bandwidth. Or to save encoding. Save GPU. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Because it has to decode the video, right? Like, the fact that I'm watching Twitch is probably just the fact that I'm playing a game at the same time. So, it's like I, it's prioritizing this over uh, decoding the video. All right, let's go here. What do I look like? What's my character look like? Oh, cool. I'm a lady. Oh, I'm a nice lady. That's, that, was, that was a terrible accent. That wasn't, like an, that wasn't anything. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. I can craft poor quality items. Crafting is 50% faster. Fine qualifier. I could do... What is... <laughs> Healing factor? I know. That would be good. Oh, yeah. We were doing 1080. We were doing 1080 at 30, but then people were having issues with it. So we dropped down to 720 at 30. And 720 and 30, like, sucked. So, then we downed it. So, then we upped it to 720 at 60. Because we could consistently do that. Now, theoretically, if we get enough viewers, we could do 1080 at 60 with the streaming computer. Our bitrate. Our bitrate is set to 3,000. And it's hovering around 3,000. So I don't know if I don't know if we need a higher bitrate to run at 60 FPS or what than what we're currently doing. Uh, what the hell is that noise? All right. Don't Um, Hops, are you actually in the apartment? And you're just, like, trolling me? Hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> One second. <laughs> Um, okay. <laughs> so it sounded like there was someone knocking on the other side of the wall here, which is also in our apartment. And Hops is at work right now, so it couldn't have been her. Uh... Whatever, it's fine. 
don't worry. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna escape this. I'm, I'm just hearing stuff probably because it's a little a little nerve wracking playing this. Let's get out of here. I keep hearing knocking though. Someone's in my house. I just looked to see if it was if I I looked to see if it was Lizzie and Lizzie was just chilling on her cat tree. When we also, uh, Regeltis, when we get everything switched over to the streaming PC, so we got, so this morning I got OBS set up. Um, I use, I got the exports and the imports done. So that's working. So when we switch over to that. Oh, excuse me, sir. Please stop. Please stop, sir. Um, so when we switch over to that, I'm just going to crank the bit, right? Yeah. I'll crank, <laughs> I mean. I don't think there's a there shouldn't be a downside to cranking the bitrate, is it? Unless it causes bandwidth problems for people watching. Um, the zombie's moving at half a mile an hour, and I can't seem to hit it. There we go. Seventeen. Okay, it's a little after five. All right. So if I can just. That's all right. So this is this house is done. I finished that house. I have. I'm good. Okay. I should. Hmm. Okay. Can I make iron arrows yet? Do I have to get a thing for iron arrows? Arrows. Iron arrow. Mm, I can make them. So let's do that. So let's go up here and try to find another building to sort of hunker down in. Yeah, I don't like I don't like knocking. Like I don't know what this knocking is, but it sounded like someone was literally like on our dividing wall. And the only way that could be the case, excuse me. Only the only way that could be the case is if there was someone in our apartment. But I'm resigned to the fact that maybe I'm just a little on edge cuz I'm playing a zombie game. And it no longer looks terrible because I no longer have it on low. But I keep hearing knocking, so maybe maybe that's not the case. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Yo, okay, so this house is a house that I want in real life. Preferably not in a zombie apocalypse. But that's this is a this is a this is a real life goal right here. So because that kind of house is a real life goal, I'm living in it. Zombie apocalypse, I can take what I want. Let's kick it. We just gotta clear it out first. Oh, gotta. There's some. There are some holes, so we're just gonna have to patch that up real quick. Make sure the neighbors aren't gonna eat us. All that kind of good stuff. Come on. <laughs> I love it. I love the. Yeah, that's good. Oh god. It does look like something you'd find in Vermont. It looks like what what is it? A snow chalet or whatever it's called? Is that what they are? The chalet style homes? By the way, it's pretty cool. Get more. When we were playing this on stream, um, and I still do, but ever since starting to play this, whenever I see like a bird nest, I get a minor little endorphin rush because they're pretty common, but they're just rare enough, and they they give you the the they give you feathers, and the feathers are so important that it, that it's like when I see it, I'm like, oh, damn, some good loot finally. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes any sense. All right. This is going to be... All right. This is going to be our home. Look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me. Uh, sir, you've been evicted. You've been, you have one day to... Oh, my God. Okay. See, as soon as I start getting cocky, 
immediately something goes wrong. All right, that's fine. Patch this up. Now we're gonna create a couple of boxes. Yeah, this will be where we stay. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't want this thing in here though. This thing's garbage. Cause this is gonna be where my boxes go for storage. Oh, I can't. Oh my God. It's harder to destroy potted plants than it is doors. I don't think, is that the same as in real life? That it's harder to destroy potted plants? As door? I, I hear something. Oh my God. Don't break down my door, man. All right, repair that. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Good Lord. Get out of my face with that. No, don't. I hate this. Okay. Some boxes, it's box, right? Do we need nails? No, not storage box. Um, sto storage chest. There we go. Grab three of these. Meh. I haven't used any of these schematics yet. I don't know how to use these schematics. Yeah, they are tough plants. Like, what the hell? Okay, there we go. Alright. Let's start popping these things in here and all. Eat separate. Raw iron that goes in there. Raw iron that goes in there. Iron. The zombies in this game are so loud. It's unbelievable how loud they are. It does not feel like the sound for the zombies is balanced at all with the rest of the sound in the game. Unless that's under ambient sound. Let me see that. Let me see if I can fix it by uh, changing the ambient sound. Get out of here, chair. Get out of here, chair. I need room in my kitchen. I don't need stupid tables. Stupid chairs. Because this is no longer a kitchen. This is my bedroom. I mean, I probably would have been... Uh, hold on. That feels stupid. That feels stupid knowing that there's probably a dedicated bedroom up here. Oh, there's also zombies up here? I mean, who would have seen that one coming? Excuse me, man. Excuse me, man. There we go. All right, now we got big mamma jam over here. This little pop. When they fall down and they don't die, that is so misleading that I always, even though I don't see the XP thing pop up, I always, 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 yes. I always, always, always think that they've died. Is this bright enough? Better barter. Got these guys. We're slowly building our way back up to where we were pre-computer. Also, wow, these reflections are... I just want to get rid of the reflections, but no. We got a freaking purse out of it. Ow! Fuck off! Oh my god! Good lord! Where the hell did he come from? Oh, did he break my door? Yeah, god damn it. Okay. That's fine. I didn't need a door anyway. 
Y'all are the friggin' worst, man. No, don't do that. Just... God. There. If only you could do this, do things this fast in real life. Put a frame. I keep hitting I because I'm used to Conan. Instead of tab. There we go. And we'll replace that nice, lovely bed with with a cra <laughs> with a crappy bedroll. A nice little sleeping bag. Alright. I think it's gonna be it's gonna be dark in an hour and a half, or so. It gives me just enough time to put all this random crap in here. Glass shard, we're gonna have this be here. Here we go. Um put that there, I guess. I don't know. Like the frame rate drops, so I'm even getting frame rate drops here with the with the lighting. I am on ultra, but it's also a 2070 now, so like maybe. All right, let's see. Can of chili, painkillers, bottled water. Pop this over here. Pop. That's it, right? That's really all I wanna. Oh, the eggs, too. And the tokens, because I don't need those yet. And the cloth fragments. So, like, a bunch of other stuff. Okay. Put those eggs away. All right. Then we're going to make a quick... We're going to get rid of you, and we're going to create another... What is going on, Indra? How's it going? What's up? Thank you for stopping by. Right. We decided to switch things up a little bit. I was going to play Conan. And I did for a while, but... It's just, it, it it doesn't have, it's it's hard to keep it, oh, this game? No, 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 this game is, I, I, I want to say not really finishable. You essentially just try to go as long as you can. Oh my god, it's dark outside. The contrast, oh my god. You want to go as long as you can. But, um, no, we haven't finished this game. And I'm just doing a quick solo one, because when I switched to my new computer, my old progress got wiped. So, instead of bringing over that other progress in the pre-built city, I figured, you know, what the hell, I'll just do a new game and a completely new random city. And we'll go from there. How are you doing? What's going on? It's getting pretty late where you are. <laughs> I can't tell if this is the game. I can't tell if this is the the game brightness that's down or if it's my monitor brightness. Alright. Pop you in there. Put some coal in there. Put some wood in there. Put you in there. And now I can now I already I have water. I have an insane amount of water. Look at all this stuff. Who keeps empty cans? Oh my god. I'm absolutely... Some late night entertainment. Well, hopefully I can provide a little late night entertainment. I was playing Conan. I mean, you... Uh, I know I started saying this before, but... I was playing Conan, and it's just... It doesn't seem like... It, it's a hard game, for me anyway, to stay like jazzed up through. I'm sure, I know other people can because it's a very popular thing to stream, but for some reason I just can't. I just start, my energy starts flagging and I just want to do something else. But it's good. It's a good chill out game. Yeah, I did already get a new PC. We ordered it during um, Amazon Prime Day over here and it it got there here in one day. So we set it up and then we got, we just went ham on a whole bunch of stuff. We got like... We have a whole ton of... So we, we're setting up my old PC as a dedicated streaming PC. And then... Oh, it's nighttime. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Um, I can't see Jack. Oh, 
Yeah, it's 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 not like it doesn't have a lot of tension to it. It's just build attack, build kill, build kill. This oh god. Apparently I had a zombie in my bathroom this whole time. Whereas this at least has the tension of the whole zombie thing. And I cannot stress enough. So I, so on the stream, this might be perfectly visible, but I also got a new monitor and, and the contrast on this new monitor is way better than my old monitor. And I can't see Jack in this house. I need to make a torch like as soon as possible, but I don't have any, I don't have any animal to make a torch with. So like if I'm looking over here, this might be visible, but except for this light that I'm looking at, on my monitor, everything is black. This is just all completely dark. Like, it's wild. I don't, I mean, I like it. I like it from a, I like it from an aesthetics standpoint, but from a gameplay standpoint, it's tough. <laughs> Alright, so I can't really go down there yet. I need another I need another I need another torch. <sighs> okay. Glue. What the hell? Glue. Large bone murky water. Large bone murky water. Large bone murky water. I I guess I could keep I can keep the large bones in murky water. I didn't realize you could use murky water to make glue. I mean, I'm probably I probably did know that, but I forgot it. Okay. Rotting flesh, mmm, delicious. Brown dye, okay. So to make a torch, to make a torch, I need animal fat, cloth fragment, wood. I have cloth fragments. I don't have any animal fat. I just want to make sure we're not dropping any frames. All right. I mean, I guess I can just... This is going to make it impossible for anyone to see anything, though. That's the problem. <laughs> if I take it, but I can't see anything myself, so... Here we go. All right, let's go on this adventure. Let's explore this house while it's nighttime. Ooh, ow. We can make healing stuff. I just have to learn how to farm. Holy shit! No, oh, hate, hate this. Hate this. Can't see. Can't see anything. Uh-oh. Plus side, at least I died inside my house. Oh, this is a mistake. Spawn on my bed and I don't have anything to like protect myself with. Okay. Um, medical supply. Wish I saw that earlier. Oh, they're breaking down my... Oh, this is going very poorly so far. What does this do? Strength three. Carrying capacity water. Okay. I can... I can box can't see anything oh my god hey hops you want to play this game with uh with our new monitors <laughs> can't see anything just punch her in the face just stop it stop it oh this is Oh my god, I cannot. I just boxed a zombie to death? Please stop bleeding. Also, they broke down my... They broke down my door! 
Oh god. Do you think I could sneak in and get my stuff back? Where where did the other zombie go? Where did the other zombie go? I don't I don't like this. Alright, hold on. Door. It's a good thing it's so fast to create a door. Okay. All right, make another one here. All right. All right. Yep, broke my door. Hold on. That's not what I want to do. Okay. All right. Well, we've already died once, and it hasn't even... I think we died before it ticked over to midnight, so we've officially died in our first day. So... Dun, 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 dun. We have failed the survive seven se the whole seven days to die survive seven days thing. That's all right. But I do want to go back down to the basement, even though there's a high probability that there are going to be zombies down there. I can always hit him with this torch. I can always hit him with the torch. No big deal, right? right I can go in here. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Oh god, she's on fire. I'm bleeding. Please stop. Oh god. Oh. Hops is, um, Hops is the one talking in chat right now. I'm too busy dying over and over again. Yeah, she sent those emojis. She's at work right now. Oh, I didn't mean to scrap. Don't scrap. Don't scrap. Drink this water. Eat this can of cooler. Oh God. I can't see anything. We still have like three hours to go before sunrise. Not a super fan of that. All right, let's go back down. Ooh, ooh what is this? Is this a secret? This looks like a secret. It's a secret. It's a wooden club. That's a terrible secret. I hate that secret. Okay. Frame. Hey, who wants to go back downstairs? I don't. But I'm gonna. Because that's what I have to do in order to proceed. I should eat this. Let me eat these painkillers too. And I don't need to eat any chili. Alright. Get some of these so I can make some bandages. I don't know, like 10 bandages? Seems reasonable. Seems like a reasonable amount of bandages. Maybe too many bandages? Because I can only make... I can only... No, no, I can hold a stack of 10. Okay. So now this stack of 10 bandages should at least help me get... That should at least prevent me from getting bleeding to death quite as quickly. But I still have to figure out where I'm going. Oh, here's another secret. Man, this house has tons of secrets in it. I love it. There we go. Search purse. More painkillers. 
Can't beat it. Love it. All right. Let's go back down to this freaking hell hole because we keep getting ambushed by zombies every time we come down here. Oh my god. I'm surprised every time too. You'd think I would be used to it. Oh, this zombie was apparently rich before he died. All right, Indra. Good luck on your exam tomorrow. Thanks for stopping by. Ah, right. Frames. Make like I don't know, 10 of these dudes. It's fine. Okay, we're going to block this up. And then I'm going to have to probably... Where, am I blind? Yes, I was blind. Sorry, I was like, "Where'd the frames go?" <gasps> I can't see anything. All right. Yeah, I mean, I probably this was probably the big problem all along. In fact, I had a gaping hole in my wall that I actually pointed out when we came in here to begin with, and I was like, "Yeah, I'll fix it eventually." And they can't get through that that little thing at the top, so. All right, what time is it? It is three thirty. So once I once we take over the new day, I am going to have to start wrapping up because I have to pick something up from downstairs. And I have to get stuff ready, and then hopefully. Or not hopefully, and then at 7.30 tonight, it'll we'll be back on. But it'll, instead of just being me, instead of just being me talking to nobody, it'll be me talking to Hops and Hops talking to me. And then you can you can hopefully join join us for that guy. Because that'll be that'll be a lot of fun. I don't know what we're gonna play yet. Hey Hops, what are we playing tonight? Do we know? Is it more dungeon defenders? We're running. We're kind of beating our head against the wall in Dungeon Defenders a little bit. Um, oh, Taladay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Taladay had a good suggestion for a game, and I don't know if you'd be into it. But it is a. It's a game called Dead by Daylight. Okay, that was all right. It's a game called Dead by Daylight, and it is a multiplayer horror game where it's an asynchronous multiplayer game where some people control um, survivors and one person controls, like, a horror, like, uh, some licensed horror monster like Freddy Krueger or Jason or something like that. And basically, you have to work together in order to, sur in order to survive, like getting killed by Jason or getting killed by Freddy. So I don't know if you'd be into that or if you want to do that, but sounds pretty fun to me. But apparently the uh, apparently the community is kind of is kind of bad. That's the only downside. The community is kind of bad, so we might want to just play with people that we know. So anyone that has it, any people that um, We'll see, yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Or we could play Five Nights at Freddy's. I think people want to see you play that quite a bit. I mean, by we, I mean you, not me. Because I don't want to play that at all. All right. All right, so we blocked up downstairs. 25 wood. I would like to go and get more wood, but you know, it's night outside. I'd rather not die. I already searched this book. Yes, right. Yeah, it has paper in it. I don't know why I didn't take the paper. 
get there. Put the steroids in there. Okay, cool. And let's head back downstairs again. Check these washing machines. Ah. Uh, hold on. What, do, what am I wearing right now? Um, I don't want shorts, but I do want a cowboy hat. There we go. I look like someone who parked her truck 80 miles from the lake. Or the lake 80 miles from Santa Fe. Bust through the door real quick. Alright. Look at this. Medical cabinet. Oh, I love it. Ammo pile. Food crate. Garbage. Two food crates, actually. Mm. Is this good viewing for everyone? Do you do you like this? Is this good? Is this fun to see? Is this fun to watch? I'm just going to go ahead and uh, do this real quick. Alright, 334. So once we take, yeah, once we take over the new day, I'm going to have to have to put a pause in this and then we'll be back at 7.30. Boom, perfect. We'll be back at 7.30 with the duo. The two and only Hops and Barley. I'm not taking that stupid Shamway sandwich. That Shamway sandwich is nothing but bad times. I actually watched Tea and Toasty play seven days. And Tea and Toasty actually died from eating one of those Shamway sandwiches. So, I am 100% not going to use it. And here we are. All right. Pop this stuff in here real fast. Pop, pop. Yep. All right. Put more steroids in there. All right. Well, um, thank you for everyone who stopped by. Um, that'll be it for now. I'm going to run downstairs. I'm going to do what I have to do here. And then uh, we will be back at 730 with something with a game. Uh, we got suggested a few games. We got suggested Portal Knights, uh, which is a good co-op game. We got suggested Dead by Daylight. And, of course, we can always go back in to Dungeon Defenders 2. Anyway, thanks for everyone who stopped by. And I will see you later. We will both see you later. Have a good rest of your afternoon.